Capstone in Tuscaloosa, Alabama. It's Lee, SEC's Game of the Week. This afternoon, it's the Arkansas Razorbacks taking on the Crimson Tide of Alabama. We're live from Bryant-Denny Stadium. William Watts will kick off. And it comes down to Corey Nichols. Moves outside and is beyond the 30 to the 34-yard line. And it's uh, much to Barry Lenny's liking. Play fake, and he sells it very well. Complete to the tight end, Herringer. And Herringer is down to the Alabama 32. Lenny. Complete to the 15-yard line to Anthony Lucas. He has plenty of leg. Nice handle of that snap by Corey Nichols, and he drives it through. So Arkansas with a nice drive to open this game, lead it by three here in Tuscaloosa. Quick drop. Malone, look out. Todrick Malone up first down. Third and 19. Bergdorf. Gets away from the initial pressure. But this is what the Jolene Dunn defensive scheme is about. Seven career points from the right hash. You just don't want to give Alabama a freebie at home. Particularly given their recent history. 43-yard field goal ties the game at three. Back after this word from your local SEC stations. Hill. That quick burst, that speed, outright speed merchant. Breaks outside, gets near midfield at the 48-yard line. That is a textbook hill run. Something. Five defensive backs in. Hill. Great call by Arkansas's offensive staff. First down at the 20-yard line of Alabama. They have it. Lunny runs the option. Madre Hill inside the 10 should be a first down. To run up the middle on this Alabama defense. Play fake. Lenny in trouble. Lenny now has room. Barry Lenny touchdown. What a remarkable play by Lenny. After being hit by Daryl Blackburn. Control that you'd want. Third and six. Bergdorf. He brings it down and decides to carry it himself. He's dropped at the 23-yard line. Bergdorf to Brown. First down, Alabama. Lines up on. Steger bounces off one tackler. First down, Alabama. But another break for Bama. Riddle. Riddle, touchdown! Keith Jackson would say a couple of big uglies, right? All right, amen. <laughs> Second and ten. Bergdorf looking for Brown. Touchdown! Here in the opening half, Bergdorf with a play fake. And down he goes, sacked at the 25. Adair gets there. Marcus Adair. Only to have Alabama come back and play opportunistic football to grab a 17-10 lead. Here at halftime, versions Brown at the top of your screen. This will be a running play, Riddle no game. Nice defensive work by the corner. Spencer can an 11. Lenny straight drop, and there's Shannon Brown, but he couldn't come up with it. Fumble. Arkansas recovers. Big numbers. That could be a safety. It is. Madre Hill is stopped in the end zone. Third and six. Bergdorf. 
picked off by Mark Smith. Down to the 17-yard line. And a marker comes flying down after the tackle. Try. Slide angle right. And he does get it through. A 22-yard field goal for Lotterette brings Arkansas to within six. But the faithful love what their defense did. We'll be back after a local break. Third down nine, Bergdorf. Oh, down he goes. Conley on top of him. Oh, Conley, Conley, nobody touched Conley. Lunny, crossing pattern complete to Eubanks. And to Blitz, they pick it up. Lunny tucks it and moves. Down to the 31-yard line of Alabama for the shotgun. Lost the ball. Down he goes. Riddle. Stopped by the safety coming up. Strong safety, Mike Nunnerly. Second down. They'll call it 10. Lenny. For Eubanks, he has it. First down, Razorbacks at the 18. And on that way. Oh, he missed it. Timmy snapped the ball early. The, the corner, the holder was looking back at the kicker. Yeah. Option play. Quick pitch to Riddle. Not much room trying to follow Sissom. Ball at the 23 for Arkansas. Lenny, quick drop. Eubanks, nice grab. Anthony Eubanks up to the 45, maybe the 46-yard line. Wow. Fourth and eight. Lenny. Wide open. And down the sidelines to the 25-yard line. The wide receiver. Coming up with that reception, Anthony Lucas, who's been there all day. Lenny. Metters. JJ to the three. Nice and goal, Arkansas. Now you got to call timeout. 50 seconds in. In the balance. Lenny. Metters, touchdown, Arkansas. Extra point forthcoming from La Tourette. With six seconds left, Arkansas could, for the first time ever in their storied history, beat an Alabama football team. The Razorbacks lead it 20 to 19. That catch, that catch has got to be the most incredible catch. As Metters went into the end zone, his feet slide out. He's up at the top of the screen. See him in the slot? Now watch. The last second, the ball's delivered. Watch where he catches the football. That's, you'll watch Lunny. Lunny at the end's going to say yes all the way. Now watch Metters. His feet slide out from under him. Watch the ball. Got his hands underneath. You see his hands scooped underneath? That ball couldn't have been an inch off the ground. It was put where it had to be. Oh, look how close it is from that angle. Very close. Look at them. They're saying, oh, no, he trapped it. Cedric Samuel certainly wanted that call to go his way, as did Andre Sun comes up. <laughs> it will be the pooch again, this time angling for Curtis Brown. Curtis Brown is down, and the ball game is over. The Arkansas Razorbacks have beaten number 13, Alabama for the first time in the history of the two institutions. Two of Bears disciples meeting at midfield. And for the Gadsden, Alabama native, a special
sweet victory indeed. His daughter Jennifer is still in school here in Tuscaloosa. What a moment for him and for J.J. Matters who had dropped a pass that could have been for